newest for me girl. And let's not make you wait any longer. Can you guess who said this line? Beauty is not only about the looks. It's really about what's within. Your personality, your beliefs, and the way you carry yourself. That's beauty. How about this? You have to believe in yourself so others believe in you. Guys, I think you are ready. With an undeniably beautiful face and a character fueled by determination and perseverance, the girl has gone from a shy teen to a girl that makes everyone fall in love with her charm. Everyone. Get to know more about her as we welcome her on stage. For me, girls, give it up for Maureen Rob! Uh, I'm a laughing 
emojis like with the tears because I like I'm always laughing, and then the upside down emoji, uh, and then the annoying emoji. Like those are my favorite emojis. I can keep on using them. Hi. <laughs> All right. Next question. What's your favorite? What's your favorite Tagalog word and why? Um, a lot. Of, I, I don't know if a lot of people know this, but I keep saying hi nako, <laughs> and I just like you, um, using that word. So yeah, that's my favorite Tagalog word. It's not a word, but it's an expression. Hi nako. Well, you sound really cute singing. Where? What are some things that uh, you feel you can't live without? <laughs> um, well, I can't live without my phone, and of course, I can't live without food. Uh, uh, yeah. Everyone loves food. Right. I know this guy loves food. Oh, you love food more. And your phone. <laughs> so you're right. Alright, next question. What did you want to be when you were a kid? Uh, when I was a kid, I wanted to be uh, a vet. And then I wanted to be an actress and then model. So first vet, I would say. You always loved animals? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> I love that. Okay, these are rather deep questions. You can kind of dig deep for this one. Deep. What is your advice to the millennials on how to dress up confidently? Well, you should feel comfortable in what you're wearing, and you should like you should stick to what you like. If you like something, you should just wear it, and you shouldn't care if other people like it or not. So, if you like it, you feel comfortable with it, then just wear it. That's true. If you like it, just wear it. So, next question. What is the most difficult or scariest thing you have ever done for a shoot for you? Um, well, I had this shoot where you had to hold laptops, and I'm very clumsy, so that was scary for me. <laughs> because, um, yeah, I was so scared that I was gonna like let it fall or something and break it, so that was kind of scary for me. I don't, I can't think of anything scarier or more difficult than that. <laughs> Another question, how would you describe your own personal style, Marty? My own personal style, it depends on my mood. I can be girly, I can be simple, casual, but it's like usually I like wearing jeans and like a plain top, like white usually. I like wearing white tops, so, so yeah. Alright, next question from Maori X Maori. What, who or what motivates you to join the, these kinds of competitions? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> who or what motivates you to join these kinds of competitions? Uh, well, I only joined one competition, Asia's Next Top Model, and uh, well, my family really motivated me to, to join. And then my manager right there. Miss <laughs> Ginny Go! All right, another question from uh, Louise, my inspiration. As a model, what would you like to say to young girls who look up to you? Um, who, look, who look up to me? Well, I'm just gonna say that I really want to like inspire you to also follow your dreams um, because like anything, you're capable of doing anything if you just try and work hard. So just follow your dreams and don't let anyone uh, tell you otherwise or bring you down. Like just follow your dreams. Such a good advice. So, Maureen, Love you. what is your hidden talent other than eyebrow talent? Um, well, I don't really have ta other talents. <laughs> I don't Give a sample of your eyebrow talent. Oh, it's not a talent, but I can like move my eyebrow. <laughs> so good. <laughs> Thank you. Another question. What is the best thing for you about being a model? Um, the best thing for me about being a model is um, meeting new people and then creating art because I love seeing like the photos after and especially if it's like a cover or something. It's like I'm just really proud of it and that's the for me the best thing about being a model. So what can you say to your loving fans and supporters? Yeah, I love you. <laughs> love you. Thank you so much for supporting me until now. Um, Thank you to everyone who watched the show and thank you just for sticking around. Thank you. I <laughs> love you. Okay, another question. 
What advice would you tell to those who have interests themselves in being modern? Um, well, I can just say you have to be mentally and physically prepared because it's not an easy job. Um, you have to wait a lot, like so, so you have to be patient. There's a lot of waiting. Um, and then just believe in yourself and yeah, you can do it then. So when you were little, did you imagine yourself being where you are today? Uh, never in a million years. Like, hi daddy! <laughs> Everyone's looking at you now. Um, no, I never in a million years did I imagine to be where I am right now. When was the last time you tried something new? Um, well, new, I tried new food in terms of combined. And I tried like stingray, or I, and I tried like bee pollen, but that was not too nice. You tried stingray? Yeah. How would you say that tastes? I've never done that before. Well, it's, it's good. It's preference. Some people like it. So, what's your favorite outfit from for me? You said that already. I said already. Well, oh no, this is my new favorite, favorite outfit. This is my new favorite outfit. Alright, here we have it. Did Bianca asks another time. The questions are in the back? The whole time. Oh, no. <laughs> I didn't see it. She wants to ask you. What's your message for aspiring models that is not that pretty or tall? Well, you don't have to be pretty in modeling. Um, there's high fashion modeling and you don't have to be pretty for that. Um, so, yeah, and then for like not so tall models, like I'm not tall, I'm just 5'6", um, but you should just believe in yourself, don't feel intimidated by the taller models and just know that you can do it as well and that you're and your <laughs> personality should be taller than your height. So that's a very good quote you have there. So, how do you have confidence in modeling? Well, you should just be confident and just do it. When you love doing it, then yeah, it's, it's for you and you should yeah, do it. Alright, this is our last question and it's from Trisha Avanzado. If you were given three wishes, Mario, what would you wish for and why? Oh my gosh, I don't know. Um, well, I wish to explore a lot of places and to travel around the world. Um, I wish, I have no idea, help me out, I don't know. Like, I would give the wishes to other people. All three? Yeah. What a girl, Every applause, just for that. Thank you, Maureen. What a great way to end our Twitter Q&A. And that reminds me, guys, don't forget to post your pictures online using the hashtag, using the hashtag Maureen loves for me and and for me clothing and for me girl. All right. Did you learn new and awesome stuff about Maureen? I bet you all did. Don't go anywhere because there are more exciting things coming up next. For the past few days, for me, has been holding online contests in which five lucky, five lucky Instagram winners will get a chance to learn different kinds of poses personally from Maureen and of course, walk with her on the runway. A few winners were already lucky enough to be with Maureen earlier today. Those winners were given the chance to shop with Maureen at our Formi boutique and learn fashion tips from Maureen herself. But now, let's focus first on our five lucky Instagram winners. May we now call on Chesabelle's 22, Kit Kat Curry, Prissy Antolatino, Ace oh. Patricia, and Shaky Lamariel. Uh, where are you from exactly? I'm from Bingen Laguna. Woo, let's hear it from Bingen Laguna! Anyway, so we have one special question for you. How does for me fit your fashion preference? For me fits my fashion preference. 
fashion preferences because it makes me more comfortable, confident in me. Thank you. Oh, Chessa, where are you from? Signature poses. She will. Then our lucky Formiga will attempt to copy Marie, whose essay they walk together on the runway. You better make it, take it serious, girl. So, figuring out all your new best poses and angles can be a lifesaver. And that said, here's a quick tutorial on how to pose and walk from Maureen herself that every Formiga girl should know. Girls, are you ready?
glamour walk. Show us how to be glamorous, love. Thank you. 